here from the Collier County Public Library for another edition of Storytime Encore. And this week in Storytime, we did winter stories. Ooh. It may not be cold and snowy in Florida, but in lots of the places up north, it is. So we always like to do a story time on winter. My first book that I read is called Cold Turkey. And this is a brand new book by uh, Corey Rosen Swartz. And it's very funny because it's about a turkey who's all wrapped up for winter and he meets the other animals in the woods and slowly but surely lets them borrow all of his clothes. So you'll find out what happens to him in the end. Another book that we read is called Red Sled. This is a great book for rhyming. It has a lot of rhyming words in it. Very simple text and uh, beautiful illustrations all about the things that you can do in winter on a sled. And then the last one is, um, and this book is by uh, Patricia Thomas. Uh, the last one we read is called Wonderful Winter and it is by Jennifer Walters. And this again is a great book uh, that's very short and simple and easy to read. And it's about uh, boys and girls having fun in a winter wonderland, building a snowman, sledding, having hot cocoa. So great story. We also uh, did a little rhyme uh, about snow. So the snow is on the roof, the snow is on the ground, the snow is on the window, and the snow is all around. We did that three or four different times. Children love finger plays because it's all about repetition and they like to use their hands. So that's a fun one that you can do with them. We also did five little snowmen. So we have them one, two, three, four, five, and they're all in the snow until the sun pops out and they all start to melt. So that's lots of fun for the boys and girls. And then lastly, in our, our craft, we made a really fun snow craft. I cut out some bare trees. So you can just get some brown paper and cut out some bare trees. Um, we glued it onto a piece of blue construction paper. Just like this. And then I got some white washable paint and a little Q-tip. This was our uh, paintbrush and we just dipped uh, this into the paint and they love doing this and made all kinds of little snowflakes all over the tree and on the ground just like it was snowing like this and then I had uh, some little foam snowflakes that I let them glue on the top too uh, little extras just to show that the bigger snowflakes made the little snowflakes. And this was our finished product. A snowy winter scene. So this was lots of fun and uh, be sure and check out all of our story times on our website and either register or go to any that we have here at our nine libraries. And everybody have a great week.